Oh, the gold market. By the way, the Dow is now down 140 points, as expected. But we can't ignore gold because gold is also down this morning. Down 14 bucks as we speak. Let's bring in Peter Schiff with Euro Pacific Capital. All right, gold down $14 in a day when stocks are down as well. Your analysis first of the gold decline. Go. Well, I think gold's been going down because people have the wrong assessment of the U.S. economy and the desirability of owning gold. But what's more important is look at the bond market, Stuart. Bond prices are dropping. The yields on the 10-year are now at two and a quarter. Rising interest rates are the, Achilles, are the Achilles heel of the phony U.S. recovery. I don't know why nobody is worried about it. This is going to be a massive tax increase. It's much bigger than what we were looking at when we were worried about the fiscal cliff, except this tax increase also affects the U.S. government, which is the biggest debtor of them all. I think you can see yields up at 4% on the 10-year, a lot quicker than anybody thinks, unless the Fed comes in and starts buying a lot more than $85 billion a month worth of treasuries and mortgages. So your analysis for the gold decline is the same as your analysis for the stock decline. It's all about rising interest rates and the bill that we'll have to pay for that. That's where you, 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 you same no, thing. Say, no, it's, go. No. Gold, gold is not going off down because long-term rates are rising. In fact, I think long-term rates are rising because inflation expectations are rising, because people are losing confidence in the ability of the Fed to dial back the QE. They're losing confidence in the creditworthiness of the United States, despite uh, what S&P said yesterday. Uh, so it's got nothing to do with it. I think gold is more that you have a lot of speculators that have got out of the market. They're shorting the market. I think you have a great buying opportunity in the gold market. On the other hand, the bond market is topping out. You've got a bubble that has burst in the bond market. And so the bond market is just finishing or just starting its decline. I think the gold market is about finished with its decline. All right. We hear you. Peter Schiff, thanks very much indeed, sir. Uh, can we just put up that board again for a second? Uh, I was going to look at the. Can you just show me the 10 year Treasury again? Is, what is that? Is it 2.25% now? Because that's a benchmark. That's very interesting. 2.27%, I think we're at on the 10 year. It yields up pretty sharply. There you go. 2.25%. That is the development which, according to Peter Schiff and others, is moving stocks and gold this morning. All right.